Hello, welcome back to another Python tutorial. My name is Tom with Mastercode Online. In today's tutorial, we're going to take a look at a Lambda and if statements. So let's go ahead and just jump right into this. We'll try to make this quick as possible. And there's a reason why I'm covering this, and that is it's, uh, to my knowledge, impossible to use elif in a Lambda uh, expression. So let's go ahead and take a look. Let's do uh, f is equal to Lambda um, a colon... And we're going to do, uh, let's do same. All right. So if it's true, we're going to get same. So we're going to do uh, same if A is equal equal to 100. And then else, uh, we're going to just put not same. All right. And we'll do F and then 100. Just like that, we got same. All right. Because I passed 100. If I did F and 50, like that, not same. All right, so we're passing the ifs, or in the if statement. On the left hand side goes what we want to return if it's true, and on the right hand side, we return what is uh, else, all right, or false in this case. Now, <clears throat> I was sitting here thinking about this when I was going to do this tutorial. And I was like, wait, is it possible to get an elif in here? And it, it's not, to my knowledge. So we're going to try it. And we'll do an A, and then we'll do same. We'll kind of do the same thing here. If A is equal, equal to 100. And then if I do um, same as 50, and then elif A is equal, equal to 50, and then I do else... And just pass not same, I believe we'll get an error. Yep. Uh, so that does not work. One way we could work around this is if we did f is equal to lambda a, and we're going to nest the if statement. So we'll do same if a is equal equal to 100. Then we'll do else. And then in here we're going to nest an if statement. And we'll say if a is equal equal to 50. Uh, wait, on. Oh, press something. Uh, same as 50 and then we'll do if a is equal equal to 50 else and we'll just print not same like that well let's see what happens with uh, 50 same as 50 all right f 100 boom like that so if you want to use elif, you're going to have to nest in a um, another if statement. So after the else, you nest in your if statement, and there you go. And that's how it works in Lambda or an expression in itself. So if you guys have any questions, please let me know. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next tutorial.